Hello everybody, it's Joel from Silver Arrow Cars and I am here with our no reserve 1989 Jaguar XJS convertible V12 in tungsten metallic over Seville gray leather interior and this is probably one of the most well preserved 1989 anything that we have had. It is stunning and we really wanted to make sure that we had this video before the car left to show you exactly how tidy and how well kept it was been. Obviously sat in a Jaguar collector's uh, collection for a number of years uh, until it traded hands and then came to us uh, through another collector as he was upgrading to something else. So very original it has documentation both in the carfax and we're trying to get the paper documents but going all the way back to when carfax started you can see every increment every oil change every service year after year after year and it shows both in the way that it drives but also the way it is preserved on the interior the roof the boot cover um, the fog light covers which i'll show you in a minute but everything on the car is spectacular. So I'm gonna start with the exterior and the front of the car. First of all, coming across the front, everything from the headlight lenses to across the grill, uh, the vinyls or the rubbers across that front bumper, the acrylics in the turn signals and the parking lights, uh, even the black paint on the windshield wipers, or sorry, not the windshield wipers, the uh, headlight washers, those aren't pitted. The front leading lip of this hood, which normally on a car like this would have chips, and there's one small one, but would have chips and pitting all the way across it. You don't see any of that, and it's a beautiful color. You'll see it in the outdoor videos and the driving videos, but the gloss is extremely extremely good and to rem and to to make mention this car is 26,000 miles 28,000 miles or 46,000 kilometers which is crazy crazy low for something this age so moving back to the hood i've got really nothing i want to point out just beautiful paint right across the entire front of the car. The wheels are in fantastic shape. These were a premium option wheel at the time. The center caps look fantastic. Uh, I don't know if these were resurfaced at one point along the way, but in incredible condition. Tires, um, very soft and gummy still. I'll look for a date code for you. Um, but the tires are in fantastic shape. The pinstriping down the edge of the car, uh, all very, very pristine. Uh, the mirror caps, hello. Uh, the stainless trim around the windshield. Here's your VIN. The acrylics in that cowl grill. Windshield wipers, very, very, very limited pitting. I can't find any large chips. Just the odd mark in the glass. The glass is fantastic. Looks like to be the original triplex glass. <clears throat> Door handles. These are extremely cool, by the way. So here's your outer handle, and it's this piece as it angles up into the door that releases the door. Down the side of the car, dead straight, no corrosion. Exemplary. Same thing with the rear wheels. Super, super clean. Rear bumper and acrylic. Super tidy. And this is gonna be very repetitive as I go around the car, but just pristine and near perfect everywhere.
those gas struts seem like new and if you look into all these crannies and the gutters underside of the trunk that cad plating on the latch that is just incredible the preservation there is your spare full-size spare your tool roll battery compartment all the carpets in the trunk look fantastic imagine this is a bag for the boot or for the tonneau fitment on panels is perfect as it should be those acrylics on the rear lights fantastic there's that the rubbers and plastic along the rear bumper just super super tidy again like the other side I've got nothing I want to point out here no asterisks the mirror caps are even near perfect so looking inside the car There's that stainless door sill plate. The carpets are in really good shape. And we talked about it in the drive video. Uh, heated seats work. The power lumbar you see there, that works. Stereo sounds fantastic. Look how clean it is in there. Armrests, they're like new. Wood trim on the upper door. The seats, all the services on the seats. The Seville gray. It's like new. All the uh, cushioning in the seats is very fresh. Here you can see all the original books. There's the original service manual showing that it was sold new at SC Sports and Classic Cars on Roderick Street here in Victoria, British Columbia. There's the date. Sold on June 24th, 1989. There's your VIN. Hold tight with me. Sorry about that. And then your original pouch with your notepad, owner's manual, the original salespeople on the service manager, and your warranty card. The rear tonneau or boot cover is like new. Extremely rich color, no wear points. Here's your XJS convertible Jaguar uh, experience tape that would have come new with the car. That's pretty cool. And then this is your head cleaner for your tape deck. Over to the driver's side, very much the same as the passenger side. Extremely tidy. Those seats are still like new. No chafing. Bolsters look fantastic. The steering wheel feels new in your hands. 
all the gauges and the acrylics the acrylic clear is crystal clear no dust in behind it the illumin the blue illumination on the gauge cluster is perfect the chrome on those ashtrays same thing just really really impressive opening up underneath the hood same thing gas struts are like new hold up the hood exactly the way it's supposed to but look at the underside all that cad plating is the original cad plating that would be way too much to go through and redo in a restoration environment you can see all of the increments sometimes a thousand or two thousand kilometers between services uh, at very reputable uh, British car and service centers for Jaguar. It's incredible. You still see some factory Cosmoline along the cowl there. And the VIN number ending in 999. Heat pad. I'd say that one spot over there is the only corrosion I've ever seen on the car. And I'm guessing that's from moisture from around brake fluid. That's just surface. We showed the top operation in our driving video, so please click on our driving video if you'd like to see that. But probably the nicest XJS V12 you're going to find. Truly a survivor and an incredible piece for any Jaguar collection. We're selling this car no reserve. Top bid buys it. It is selling on an Ohio title in our warehouse in Blaine, Washington, and we can get the car anywhere it needs to go. So use the contact seller button, find us on the internet, silverarrowcars.com, and good luck.